Hello YouTube, my name is Dark and Blade Gaming, and welcome to episode 9 of my Ancient Awakened Let's Play. Last time we moved to a new world because of new world gen. And as you can see, things are quite a bit different in this new one. Namely, slimes are invading. Yeah, so I was building this arena and then slime raid events started. So today, today we're going to fight the slime king. And excuse me while I turn down... I literally shot you in the face with it. I'm getting a case of deja vu. This is exactly what happened last time. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. This is incre the Incredible Luck Episode 2. Slime King and I have Cthulhu. I'm ready. I Hello? I have Cthulhu? Are you gonna spawn or what? suddenly come from the worst possible time for you I have to do it. God, that was close. Screw you, slimes. Jesus Christ, that made it so much harder than it should have been. Like, that was just unreasonably hard. I'm at a stage in the game where that should not be that hard. Oh, and now it's pinky.
die, Pinky. Shield of Cthulhu. Climbing claws? Wait, that can't be right. That, I probably got that from someone else. From somewhere else. Cthulhu's blade, always a nice melee weapon. So that's what this episode's gonna be. We're gonna fight the Slime King next, and then we're gonna fight the Mushroom Monarch because I have the spawner. But Jesus Christ, do I hate the Eye of Cthulhu in Expert Mode. It's not that it particularly does a lot of damage, it's more that... Well, the problem becomes that it's just so hard to hit. Yeah, also I transferred over my stuff, uh, made a few new houses for NPCs. The good thing is now we're never gonna run out of jail. Okay, finally a shout up. I teleport over here. Oh god. Oh god, that thing here. That was an exciting first 10 minutes. That should help us stand out from the rifle. I already have a slitted fire, so I'm just gonna sell that. And how did you spawn down there? Wait, I actually wanna see what uh, Anubis's attack is.
Okay, it's apparently nothing except his extremely high def health. Yeah, he has 1600 health and absurd defense, so. So we got 300 gel from that. Okay, time to dump the crap I don't need. A merchant. Okay. Don't need unholy arrows. Potion doesn't need, doesn't need. Need. Banner, banner, don't need that. I already have one, so I can just trash that. Potion. Platinum ore. I'm already past that. Bomb. More potions, I don't need more food. Did I just sell my last potions? Crap. No, I sell 30. Did I... Which one does more? Cthulhu's Blade or this one? Yeah, I'd say because this blade is better at this point. Now that we need to dump the stuff we actually do want in the important stuff. First, dump this ridiculous amount of gold. Well, not ridiculous. Did I already put some pink gel in here? No. There. Time for the Mushroom Monarch. This is my friends is what we call a massacre. Without die. Not my fan. I'm not a fan of it. I'm sorry. It. Uh, I'm sorry, whoever angry pirate is. I don't know. I don't recognize your name. But you aren't up to standard. So let's see. Can I sell these? I hope I don't offend you, whoever angry pirate. I think does it does it actually show the name? Oh great! Now ah, I don't need it. Slime so gun selling that it does nothing. Do I really need that? I don't need a solidifier. I think I've already got some spore bags to make a house with. Die trader. Of course, I make two more houses and I get dryad. I don't need machinium. I know that. Do I need a cloud in the bottle? No, I have wings. Also, you guys need to update this to make it so show only one of these. Not sure how you do that, but... Should I equip this?
Oh, yes, I like this. I like this a lot. Now it becomes the problem of too many good accessories. I'm gonna go make a mushroom biome. I literally just... Yeah. And so yeah. Well, if it isn't Pinky. I just killed you. At least that actually works now. I didn't get a slime hook, but I think I already have one. that you can eat these. I need to make a house for this guy. But I'm running into the unfortunate problem of I am running out of wood. Wait, I can just make... The mush man, the mush man, the mush man. No, the mush man. Well, he knows you, and he's coming for your soul. That got dark extremely quickly. Rule number one of Terraria: Stone walls are always better than wood walls. Now let's hope the mush man actually comes here instead of some creepy old man. Yeah. So we've done a lot this episode. So I'm just gonna say, my name is Darken Blade Gaming, and for the love of God, that's for the mush man. This happened. The exact same thing happened last time. Well, my name is Darken Blade Gaming, and leave an F in the chat for mush man. Yeah.